Hello everyone. In this video, I will talk about five different ways to flatten a given list in Python. So let's get started. I'm on my VS code and here I am declaring a list which is holding few elements. So you can see that the out, uh, this is one list, but internally it is having more lists as a children. Now, how can we flatten this kind of list? To get started, let's start with the most basic and the common way to achieve this, and that is using the for loop. So let's take an empty list, which will hold our result. And then we can iterate over our parent list. So I will just take variable name as ls lst and this lst is holding these children so for that we need another for loop which will iterate over these individual lists so that's why i'm taking here ls and finally we will use append function to append all these items together okay so once this is done let's go ahead and print full list so you can see that in the output bottom terminal uh, we are having a list which is one two three four five so all the internal lists are like flattened and we are having the single list in our output now the problem with this approach is it, it is using nested loop which is not at all optimal so how can we reduce number of loops over here so second way is to use so the first way we used append with multiple loops now the second thing which we are going to try is use extend so for that we are going to take this additional list over here and rather than using all these things what we can do we will say full list dot extend and in extend we will pass our iterator over here so which is ls let's quickly run it and here you can see that the output is still the same so this is another way of achieving the same thing now let's talk about third way which is using list comprehension okay so in case of list comprehension most of the developers do not prefer that because it makes your code very short, but it's it makes very difficult to read or interpret the code. So if you are comfortable with list comprehension, this is the best way to flatten your list. So for that, what we are going to do is uh, let's let me write my code over here. So we have list, we have this full list variable and this will be holding our results. So let me first type in, then I can explain you what I'm doing lst for item in ls okay and let's get rid of all of these okay so what we are doing here is uh, it's kind of difficult to read this but what we are trying to achieve here is to go through this entire list and then again iterate over these individual children so now you can see that the same variable ls so ls is uh, denotes my internal uh, yeah, individual elements over here so let me quickly go ahead and run this and you can see that the output is again the same so this is another way of uh, achieving the same thing let me quickly show you the fourth way which is using iter tools so for iter tools you need to go ahead and import it first so import iter tools and once import is done what we can do is we will it's syntax i will show you over here so list we want the output in the form of list so we need to cast our entire result uh, with list and then i would say iter tools dot chain dot from iterable and inside that you can pass your list so it will go through each and every element and just construct a list over here so let me execute this line and you can see that the output in the terminal is still same which is one two three four five so if you are not comfortable with list comprehension this is another way to achieve the same thing now uh, one more thing which is 
which we can use is using func tools func tools so for that again we need to go and import it so i would say import func tools we have this list and then what we can do is let's remove this line and use func tools dot reduce and inside reduce will perform the same operation iteratively so that's the magic of reduce and if you are not sure what all things you can do with reduce i have already created a video specifically uh, what all things we can do with reduce so i would suggest you to go and check that out so in that case first you need to pass in operator so what is your operator here here we want concatenation so i would say concat probably we need to declare or import the operator on top and then we need to pass our list followed by the braces so i would just say import operator okay so once this is done we can quickly go ahead and execute and then you can see that output is again the same which is one two three four five so these are the five different ways we can use to flatten our list i would never recommend to go for those nested loops but apart from that you can go with any of these i hope you enjoyed this video and thanks for watching